All right, question and answer time. First up, Steve Weiss, a video question for you. Hi, this is Craig Hill, originally from the UK, now living in Atlanta, Georgia. Um, I'm asking Steve if he is still looking to buy F5 Networks. He bought it a couple of weeks ago. It looks like it's taken a dive since then. So now I need to know, is it gonna continue to dive or is it gonna come back alive? So tell me, is it a buy or a sell? Thank you. All right, what's the answer? So first of all, congratulations on picking up that Southern accent in Atlanta, um, which been in the UK. Here's what I'd say, it's a wait and see right now. Goldman came out and downgraded it to sell. They're the only ones that have a sell on it. I like the stock, I got out of it a while ago, but it's in a perfect spot. Earnings have been lumpy in terms of how management guides, but down here it's actually looking good as you turn it over to the next year when it's pretty cheap, about 16 times. So I'd wait for this quarter, see what they have to say, and then make your decision. Okay, thank you. Joey T, now video question for you. Hello, Judge. Thank you for the show. This is Dr. Satish Mittal from London. Can one of your panels please advise what I could buy to increase my exposure to energy, finance, and material? I invest 70% in US and 10% of my portfolio is Berkshire Hathaway BCS. Thank you. All right, Dr. Satish, thank you very much for that question and the comments too. Joe Terranova, what's the advice? Okay, so Dr. Satish, you already have significant exposure in financials with Berkshire Hathaway. We covered energy. The area I want you to focus on is materials. I'll give you two names, Freeport Mac Moran. The usage of copper in electric vehicles has never been stronger. And Mosaic, that's an agriculture play. Okay. All right. Good stuff.